Hey folks, it's Barry here. Welcome to My Virgin Kitchen. It's our second video recipe today in Mug Month. Hello, My Virgin Kitchen. Uh, I thought about the breakfast in mug. That would be cool. That is right, folks. We have done a breakfast in a mug. And not just any mug. We have done it in a Lionel Richie. Hello, is it me you're looking for? Mug. Or is it tea you're looking for? You know that song? Hello, is it me you're looking for? You get that first line and then you're like, Duh -duh 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 -duh. anyone else do that? Kind of me. Anyhow, if you want to make this, uh, hit pause on the video when I ching like this. Ching, this is the official noise. Okay, hit pause, write the ingredients down. I'm using an 800 watt microwave, FYI. Let's do it. First thing you want to do is grab your Lionel Richie mug or equivalent and add in your sunflower oil. So about a teaspoon of that going in there. Follow up by chucking in your baby sausages and your mushrooms. They're just washed button ones that I've quartered up and give it a little mix through to coat well. What you want to do then is plonk that mug into a microwave and give it a blast for a full minute. Now, as I said at the start, that's an 800 watt microwave. If you're using a slightly more powerful one, you might want to reduce the times down. All right. The next thing to add into our mug is our smoked bacon cut into little tiny squarey things and also some black pudding, which is optional. You do not have to go down the black pudding route if you don't want to. Uh, chuck that in there, a little stir again, and again, whack it in the microwave for another minute, blasting it all through and it should start to smell amazing. Boston's nose was doing crazy things. He, he was excited. Next up, add in your chopped cherry tomatoes, giving it a season of pepper if you wish, or you can even add some herbs if you're feeling flashy, and then add in your baked beans. Cover the mug in some cling film and pierce it lightly with a fork, then place it in the microwave initially for a minute. Uh, I did that and then actually gave it another 30 seconds just because of the power of my microwave, so adjust that to your liking. The mug will be very hot once it's at this stage, so take it out carefully. <laughs> and when you're ready, peel back the cling film, give it a little stir to bring those ingredients to the top and serving it alongside some toast that I made in the toaster, although I could make microwave bread toast, I guess. It's looking absolutely amazing. Tasting so, so gorgeous too. So that's it then guys. Uh, if you have any other idea recipes for mug month, let me know down below or send me a video request uh, to my old email address. I won't reply to you, but it's groovybaz at yahoo.co.uk. Do a landscape video saying, hey, could you make this? And I'll put you in the video. Check out my last video. And that's it guys. Uh, cheers for all the mug love. And I'll see you next time, you mugs. Crazy mugs.